Hello again YouTube and I'm back with another update and in this update here I show that I have now uh, replaced the uh, uh, ventilation fan that I had in, had in here previously uh, the, the Panasonic Whisper Sync uh, ventilation fan um, you know I don't really think it was doing a, uh, a, a, the job that I you know wanted it to uh, it wasn't you know moving out 80 cubic feet worth of air you know uh, in a normal situation yeah that, that works great it's just that there were times when you know uh, I don't think it was really keeping up so what I did was I actually went to um, Lowe's and I purchased a, um, a ventilation fan that, that they use for uh, uh, what is it my crawl spaces and uh, places like that so this is like a crawl space type fan and it moves about 186 cubic feet a minute and you know I just kind of wired it in and as you can see I um, I'm, I still have to you know kind of do some drywall work and some painting um, but you know I just installed it again this is an update for folks that are thinking about ventilation systems or something like that and just to kind of give you an idea based on what I've chosen to do and um, you know again this it, it, this is a fan that's meant to run for continuous operation so this is a continuous duty fan I can always shut it off uh, with that switch there uh, but you know I will run it all you know all the time so it takes about 69 watts continuous to run which is not bad uh, it's not bad uh, it's not like the other one the other one was energy efficient and it was an energy, energy star rated fan um, but unfortunately, it, it, it's more geared for like bathrooms and showers and places like that. Um, not for, you know, I guess for what I would want it to do. And so when these batteries are being charged, um, you know, they, get, they do give off uh, gas, hydrogen and oxygen gas. And I do have, you know, positive ventilation in the room. And for one thing, I also want, I needed a fan to get rid of the heat. Uh, if you look right here, you know, I have a thermometer and sometimes this room, because I have, you know, a hot water heater and, and unfortunately, you know, it, the days have been hot. So the air that's being blown in is sometimes hot air in addition to, you know, the hot air or the air coming from the inverter when I'm using it or something like that. Um, so I need this, I needed a fan to also blow out, you know, the hot air. Now, Hopefully this one should do the trick. Um, also, you know, you can see that the motor is enclosed. And I can get a regular like bath and ventilation fan, but uh, the motor is, it, I had one and, and the, the motor is not enclosed. And you know, that's a spark risk that I didn't want to take as well. So I chose a ventilation fan with, with an enclosed motor. And also, this one was pretty easy to install. I just simply cut a square the size of the unit, slid it through, um, you know, put some some more uh, 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 drywall, uh, you know, up top there, and I'll fix that um, so it's not a problem, and I'll just get buy some paint and paint over it. Uh, but again, this is pretty much it. Um, you can get this fan from Lowe's or, Home, or I think Home Depot may have their own version of it. And it was about $89. Um, you know, I didn't want to have to buy another fan, but you know, you know, why not? You know, it's better to be safe than sorry. Um, the other fan did was doing the job. Yes, you know, it was ventilating. You know, uh, fine. It just it just didn't stand up. You know, it wasn't doing. You know, it it wasn't doing what I wanted it to do as far as you know, uh, keeping up with the heat and the, you know the gas and so forth. Uh, but some ventilation is better than nothing. Uh, but this is this does a better job. Is it? It's not. It's not quiet. It's you can hear it. But you know the way I see it. You know there is some comfort to know that this thing is running. The other one was whisper quiet, and I do mean whisper quiet. You can barely tell that it was running. But it was indeed running, and it was it was pumping out air. Yes, it was. It, the the whisper sync fans they they're meant for continuous duty. And they will, they were pumping out, he was pumping out the air. But, you know, this right here, at least you get a sense of, hey, this thing is pushing it, okay? So this fan right here was, is actually uh, double the, uh, the force of air as far as pushing it out of the other fan. Uh, so you two, just another idea, 
uh, you know, modifications here, modifications there, upgrades here, upgrades there. So just wanted to share, you know, uh, some of the things that I'm doing and maybe give some others some ideas as well. Again, this room is just like one big battery box. Um, so I got air coming in from here, uh, being blown in from the outside there, and air being sucked out through here. So in this fan right here, 80, 186 cubic feet a minute. Um, and, you know, in an hour, it says that basically you can multiply 186 times 60 minutes, and it tells you how much air it, it actually displaces in an hour. And uh, with these batteries, you know, hey, just, you know, get out the, you know, the hydrogen, the oxygen, and whatever else, whatever other particulates are in the air. But anyway, YouTube, just an update. And, uh, you know, feel free to comment, um, and I'll try to answer any questions. All right, take care.